Are you struggling with hip pain that's making it difficult to walk or even sit for long periods of time? I'm Dr. Jess Sally with Regenex Pittsburgh. We are the premier Southwestern PA provider of interventional orthopedics and orthobiologic injections. I'm here today to talk to you about how we can work on treating your hip pain and preventing it from coming back. The first thing that we want to do is figure out where the pain is actually coming from. Most people assume that when you have hip pain, a lot of it is just coming from the joint, but there can be several different factors that play into what actually happens with the hip and how that presents pain. So how do we relieve hip joint pain? Well, the first thing is to really determine where the pain is coming from. I like to refer to the hip and all of its surrounding structures as the hip girdle. There are many different things that contribute to this, including the low back, the different muscles that surround the hip, the nerves that extend from the low back, all of the tendons that work around the hip joint and all of the ligaments that actually hold the hip joint together. All of these individual structures have to function in symmetry to be able to prevent pain and increase stability within the joint. That is going to help with optimizing your performance and also alleviating any types of pain. Now, hip pain can cause severe pain when people sit. It can cause pain when people walk, even climb stairs or doing basic activity like bending or even twisting when you walk. Most of the time when people seek care from their primary care physician or from an orthopedic specialist, they may recommend physical therapy. They may recommend corticosteroid injections, but these things may not be directly treating the area that's affecting the hip and causing the pain and may not give you the relief that that you anticipate. The Regenex procedures are minimally invasive. We target all of the different areas that encompass the hip girdle and all of the different structures that contribute to pain in the hip and all of the things that may be contributing to your pain symptoms with activity. It's very important to get the right diagnosis in the hip first so that you know what you can treat effectively. So what hip conditions do the Regenex procedures treat? Well, there's a variety of different things, including pain in the joint, pain from tendons such as bursitis or piriformis syndrome, pain from nerves, maybe nerves that are coming from the low back or other nerves that may be pinched within the hip structure itself. There are also more rare conditions like avascular necrosis, which while it does not occur often, can be significantly debilitating to patients and doesn't necessarily respond well to treatment other than surgery. The Regenex treatments in these cases have performed well to alleviate pain and give people back their function. Other common injuries like labral tears or muscle tears can also be treated effectively with the Regenex procedures. So if you're struggling with hip pain and you haven't found a good solution to get you out of pain and back to your better function, give us a call or shoot us a comment below. We would love to have you come in for a comprehensive evaluation so that we can figure out where your problem's actually coming from and perform effective Regenex treatments that will help with alleviating all the different things that are contributing to your hip pain and help you get back to function and back to life.